Hi there, welcome back to the 29th video Learn Excel with Karpagam. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create hyperlink with VLOOKUP. Let's get started. You may be wondering when I'm using a hyperlink, why should I use a VLOOKUP? This is going to be the crux of this particular video. When we create a hyperlink or when we use a hyperlink, it is not guaranteed that it will create hyperlink on its own each and every time we have to do it manually but whereas when we nest we look up within a hyperlink function it automatically generates a hyperlink based on our requirement let's get started when we look at the hyperlink function we have got two important arguments one is called as the link location link location is the website url and when we talk about the friendly name either you can choose the same name or you can go and change it according to your requirement I'm going to the hyperlink cell equal to hy tab. Where is the link location? Link location is in E9, comma. What is the friendly name that I want to give? The same name, close the bracket, hit enter. Now that you can see automatically a link is created. When I click on this, it automatically takes me to the landing page of Google, which you can see it. Now I want it for Facebook or let's say now I want it for Google Maps. When I go and paste it, automatically it will not generate a hyperlink this is one of the shortcuts or the drawbacks of a hyperlink this is when we use a we look up within a hyperlink function first what i'm going to do i do not want to type the search engine or the company name each and every time so i'm going to use a data validation all d and l those who are new to data validation please click the link below in the description data validation is covered in detail go and pick up list from the allow category where is the source? Source starts from D9 till D14. Click OK. Now you can see automatically a drop down list box is created. Pick whichever you are interested in. Go back to the next cell equal to HY tab. For the link location, don't click on it here. Instead of that, use a VLOOKUP function, VL tab. Basic VLOOKUP function, follow the same methods what we have done. Where is the lookup value? Lookup value is G9, comma. What is the table array? Table array starts from D9 till E14, comma. What is the column index number? Column index number is 2, comma. Is it that we are looking for a true match or a false match? We are looking for an exact match, supply 0, close the bracket, comma. What is the friendly name that we want to give? The same name I want to give, close the bracket, hit enter. You can see hyperlink is created. When I click on this, it takes us to the landing page of Google. Go back to the data validation. Click on Google Maps or whichever you are interested in. Automatically, it's generated here. But in this case scenario, it is not generated. Click on the Google Maps. It takes you to the Google Map landing page. Pick up Swiggy. Swiggy hyperlink is created. Click on it. It will land us to the Swiggy landing page. VLOOKUP is one of the most versatile function in Excel. When you nest VLOOKUP within so many other function or other functions within VLOOKUP, it performs miracle. And this is one among that. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks for joining. Stay tuned for more such videos. See you soon.